Okay, uh, let's see. I want to show you how to select things in Ironhard. So what you can do is is just uh, select points and just click on the screen like this, and it will select the point. Select the point. Uh, now you can see uh, it's selecting according to the grid, uh, but uh, if you choose settings under a menu and uh, you can also adjust the grid to uh, like a grid snap or not so let's remove the grid snap and now it will actually put a point anywhere on your selections okay so that's one thing you can select a point and unselect it uh, second thing you can do is select points just next to the point, just double tap uh, on the x axis, x -ax x -axis uh, above and below, and then you will create a point on the uh, on the same x level. Uh, you can do the same uh, on the y axis, just on the left and right side of the y axis, like that, and then we'll select a point just below it with double tap. So that's a different way. Uh, okay, so let's move over to selecting uh, items. Just uh, let's create a let's create a line like that. Now uh, you can select uh, an endpoint like this. On all the items, you can see if we zoom out in, you can see uh, like a select point in this color. Uh, and lines have three of them always. You have one in the end like this, you have one in the middle, and you have one in the end. Uh, different items have different select points. Um, you can select items by either just selecting by tapping on it like this, uh, but sometimes if it's small, uh, it would actually select a select point instead of the item but you still want to select item you, then you can still uh, double tap like this uh, double tap uh, like, like, oh, sorry. like that uh, or double tap on one of the select points and it will select and deselect item okay and uh, what we have more is under under um, sorry, under help and select, we have these things. Uh, ah, sorry, uh, we have some more things as well. We have select by double touch, I'll guide you through that. Select by rectangle, uh, we missed that, so let's go back. So what we're gonna do here is that I can select two points like this and touch the select button and it will select all the things within that rectangle that it, uh, these two uh, selected points will create. So that's that one. Let's see what we are still missing. Help and select. So select by double touch, select by uh, rectangle, select a near point. Okay, so if I want to select a near point on this line, I just double tap on each side on that line and it will create a point on the line which will be the be the be on uh, intersection between the line between the two touches and the line itself okay so that's that let's see what we have more uh, select intersection point uh, okay so uh, that's uh, let's create a intersection like that. So I want to select the intersection point of these two lines. It doesn't have to be lines, it could be arcs or circles, uh, anything else. So I'm just gonna double tap on each side uh, of uh, that actually crosses both the lines. And as you saw, it will create uh, uh, or a, a point in this middle. So I'll do that again double tap like that and crossing both the lines and then just release and we'll create an intersection okay let's see what we next thing uh, ah select an ortho point uh, and that's quite simple just 
select two points like that and click ortho and it'll drag the point down uh, to be um, uh, on the same axis, x axis or you can just if you tap it close to the y axis it will drag it to the axis okay that's it good good